All right, so today we're gonna to be testing out the iPad using a mouse, hooking it up and such. Now I have a Logitech keyboard here, which works very well as well, Bluetooth. So to set the mouse up, I already have it set up, obviously, as you can see the cursor on the screen here. You're gonna to wanna to go to settings, accessibility, touch, Turn that on. Pointer devices. And then sync up your mouse. It's very easy to sync up. This one I got on Amazon. It's really, really inexpensive, nothing fancy. So I just wanted to test it out. And we have controls here for your tracking speed, which is really nice because it's slow now. Fast. Well, this one only has the right click and left click, but you can also set up your mouse keys here. And let's see, where's the um, pointer style size? Obviously, that's huge. Color, change the color of it. We'll just keep it gray for now. Auto hide, 15 seconds. And then we have a double tap, single tap, single tap open menus. I have nothing set for double tap, but you can have different settings in here. Let's just put app switcher on, see what happens. Long press. We'll set for drag and drop. Now if I do a uh, um, right click, by default this comes up. And then you have even more options here. I'll go to home page. Let's open up a web browser. So here we are on my YouTube channel. Please subscribe. Um, and then you just, when I'm holding down, I'm just scrolling up and down or I could just go like this drag the mouse, hold the page, drag the mouse. It's hard to see that motion because I'm on the screen here. And then if we want to get our dock, we just go to the bottom down there. Let's pull up um, So it works just as your finger would, obviously. Uh, another cool thing, it's like when you're in your files here, you can just hold down the file, or hold down the, the mouse button, and this pop-up menu comes up, which is cool for doing stuff like copying, delete, share, whatever quick look information and such, or if you just want to open the folder, obviously you just double tap as you normally would. But let's say you want to go in here, there's no files in there. Let's say you want to go into here, hold, tap and hold, and then you can do other things right here, share, and then it's gonna give you your options and such. Save the Dropbox, whatever you want to do. So I'm really liking the mouse with the iPad. This is, like I said, again, this is just a cheap mouse that I bought on Amazon. The keyboard's awesome. It's a Logitech. You could switch between um, three different devices. So I just have this in front of my computer, and I just switch between the iPad. That's not in front of my computer at the moment, actually. But it's really cool. Let's see. Swipe down from here. Your notifications. Control center, which you can also do from the double tap or the right tap, which just has this control center here. You got that. You hold and tap, you get that. Move stuff around. So overall, pretty cool. I'm really liking this. This is um, a nice thing for your iPad. 
if you really need to use the mouse. I mean, I have the Apple Pencil as well here, which can be used, but having the mouse is making it more like a laptop. It's pretty cool and I'm digging it. So check one out. I'll put some links down in this video description below. There's a bunch of them you can buy. Just make sure that they're, say, say they're compatible with iPad. So pretty cool. Check one out. Talk to you soon.